Great Amazingly, music. it's 40 yeah. years since Bob Marley died and his song continued to inspire musicians to this day. Naturally enough, when you think about it, including his grandson, Skip. Yeah, he's also a musician, a songwriter, performer, and he's back with a new single, Slow Down. Skip, we're going to ask you to speed up again because <laughs> here you are with us. We want to say hello, good morning to you. Uh, joining us live, my friend, uh, congratulations on the new music. Yes, thank you. I'm feeling love, you know, I'm feeling love, you know. Good feeling man. very blessed. Good yeah. man. Could I ask you, are you related to my friend John Marley from Belfast? <laughs> <laughs> you know, we're all, we're all related, you know. It's a one world family. So. It is, yeah. it is. But being uh, Bob's grandson, what sort of pressure does that put on you, my friend? Or, or let's put it another way, what sort of influence has he had on you? Everything, you know, and everything from from I was born, you know, my grandfather's music was being played. So there was always lessons, you know. So for me, I mean, that that inspired my whole life, you know, and he continues to inspire, you know. I mean, you, so, you, you sadly yeah. never met your grandfather, but obviously so many people must have talked about him, were influenced about him. When were you first aware of, of how famous he was and when were you first aware of his music? Yeah, I was aware, but you see the impact and when my understanding, you know, to be able to understand the impact. I remember I was probably the age of probably 11 and 12, we were in Africa, Ethiopia, I remember. And there was a tribute concert. I remember my family put on a tribute concert. And there was about 2 million Africans that came, you know, to see my grandfather and the family. So right there is the first time I really saw the impact, you know, in the flesh. Yeah. You know? I mean, he did have an amazing impact. Um, what about your, your mum, his daughter? Um, what did she tell you about him, the man, as a father, not just the artist that we all knew? Well, I mean, there's probably... I mean, to me, I mean, she tells me a lot of things, you know, but a lot of people know those things. But, you know, to me, it's more about the man himself, you know, like them sitting at dinner, you know, them going for runs, and, you know, them just talking, you know, just... just Stories that people don't really hear, you know, about it. Yeah, it Skip, is there anything about him that you have heard or that you have learned that you would like people to know? I bump into people all the time in this business and, and they'll say things like, well, yeah, I used to play football with Bob Marley. And you say, what? What are you talking about playing football with Bob Marley? And they'll say that when he lived in London, he used to kick ball on a Saturday or a Sunday in the park, he used to be, yeah. you know, be, be involved in local football leagues and things. Yeah, yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, man. And even even here in Miami as well, you know, I've heard a lot of stories like that as well. You know, them. So my grandfather was, you know, unbeatable almost. You know, your your grandfather would be very very proud of you, I'm sure. Really lovely. Thank you for that. And just to let everybody Thank know, you. Skip's new EP, Higher Place, is out now. Good luck with that. Great to talk to you. Thank you, thank you. Blessed love. Thank, thank you, you very, very much. much indeed. Thank, thank you. you.